What's going on guys? This is Mark Kaiser with The Mobile Home Dealer coming to you again today with a brief educational video. Today what we're going to do is we're going to be talking about financing mobile homes. The three most common ways to finance a mobile home, um, where to go to get financing, what's the most popular way to fund a mobile home purchase, and another way that a lot of folks don't ever talk about with mobile homes. We're going to cover that last, so make sure that you stick around to the very end of the video as I, I think you're really going to find that one interesting that we're starting to see a rise in sellers taking option number three. But before we get started, y'all know the drill. We need you guys to do us a huge favor and smash that like button and subscribe to the channel below so that you're up to speed with everything that we're doing here at the mobile home dealer. Thank you so much for being a part of the community. We're seeing a lot of good interaction with the comments. Keep them coming as we're more than happy to answer all of your questions and uh, help bring additional clarity to you with everything in the mobile home space. So thanks again for being a part of this. So let's go ahead and get started. When we're talking about financing a mobile home, um, there's a lot of misinformation out there. And again, like a lot of our uh, other educational videos, what we're trying to do here at the mobile home dealer is really try to um, pull back the tar pull back the tarp, uh, if you will, and really show you exactly how to do this uh, because there's just not a lot of good quality information out there and we wanna be the folks for you to be able to help you with that. So um, when we're talking about financing a mobile home, let's go over the three most common, like we said before. Uh, the first one is gonna be cash. Um, that is by far gonna be the most common way to buy a mobile home. Um, especially if you're buying a mobile home on leased land where you're buying the house and then you're leasing the land. Cash is probably gonna be around 90% of all sales in those types of mobile home uh, situations. Um, it's, a, it's a fast transaction. Uh, the homes are gonna come with titles with them and not deeds if you're buying it uh, on a leased land um, uh, purchase agreement in a mobile home park. So cash by far is gonna be the most common. Now, when I say cash, that can be confusing. Uh, and I wanna be completely clear here. We are not physically talking about uh, you know, cash in dollars, okay? We're not talking about showing up uh, with a bag full of money. That's, that's not what we're doing here. Uh, cash would be in the form of, say, a cashier's check or a money order. That is gonna be what we refer to as cash, okay? So not cash with dollar bills, but cash with uh, going to a grocery store or a credit union and something like that to be able to get a cashier's check or a um, stack of money orders for it. So that by far is gonna be the most uh, common way. Uh, the second most common way is going to be to obtain a mortgage. Okay, now that is going to be, um, there's a lot of misunderstanding with that, how to obtain a mortgage for a mobile home. So let's discuss this. Um, as we've discussed in other videos, you can buy a mobile home essentially three ways. Uh, and that's going to be, uh, the first one is going to be a mobile home out on land, you know, out in the country somewhere. Uh, the second one is going to be in a mobile home park where you own the house and you own the land. And the third way is going to be where you buy the house and then you pay lot rent under that. Okay. Uh, so you don't technically own the land. Now in the first two, if you buy the mobile home, uh, out in the country somewhere on a, you know, five, 10 acres, something like that, that you'll see out in more rural areas or on the second option where you buy the mobile home and you buy the land, that's gonna be viewed as and taxed as real estate. So your traditional mortgages are gonna be uh, certainly available for that type of a purchase. Now, if you're looking at buying a mobile home in a mobile home park where you're buying the house and you're leasing the land through lot rent, that's gonna be viewed as personal property. Okay, so what does that mean? Well, that means that uh, traditional mortgages are simply not going to not going to apply, uh, and the reason why is your traditional mortgage lenders like Chase or Bank of America, Wells Fargo, you know, one of those big uh, big banking institutions, uh, they're not going to lend on a mobile home unless the land comes with it. So a lot of times people who just don't really kind of know where to go from here, they think, oh gosh, I, I don't have cash um, or, or enough cash to buy the home and uh, the home's on a leased land, so I, I guess I can't buy the house. Not, not, not so fast here. Um, the good news is there are companies out there, and a lot of people don't know about them, but there are companies out there that uh, specialize in lending on mobile homes on leased land. Um, here are a couple that you may want to look at. Uh, you may want to look at uh, Triad Financial. Uh, you may want to look at 21st Mortgage. Uh, those are two good ones to, uh, to start with. Um, uh, and, and, and if you Google those or look those up and give them a call, 
they are gonna specialize in mobile homes on leased land, okay? So uh, if you're looking at buying a mobile home on leased land and you need to get a mortgage, you, you wanna give those guys a call. Now, we're not loan brokers here at this firm, um, so I can't really comment in the comment section uh, about uh, down payments or, or credits or anything like that. It's, 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 we just don't do it. So I, I, can't, I can't help you with that or no, nobody on our team can help you with that. But seriously, guys, think about that mortgage opportunity uh, if, if that's something to look at. Now, the third one uh, is one that no one really seems to know about right now, and it's becoming more and more popular for those people who know how to do it, okay? And um, that is going to be seller financing. Uh, seller financing is very, very popular in the mobile home space. Um, how that works is um, you uh, work with a seller and you tell them, hey, seller, um, uh, maybe you don't have the cash for it. Maybe you, you, you don't have a mortgage opportunity for, for whatever reason, that's your business. Uh, and then ask the seller if they would be willing to play banker for you. Um, what that usually entails is a, a substantial down payment um, for the home and then monthly payments. Uh, it, it, it resembles quite a bit of a, of a rent to own type of, type of situation. Um, make sure you ask them for that. Uh, and see if they would be open to to um, to carrying the mortgage, um, carrying the loan, that type of thing. You'd be quite surprised. Uh, right now, we are seeing a lot of folks who are open to that, um, whether it's an investment idea or or, or you know they, they just want to get it sold to the first person who comes by, and uh, they would be more uh, interested in just unloading the property and uh, not holding on to that for that cash buyer or for that mortgage buyer. Um, so guys, really entertain the idea of um, the, the, the mortgage idea with those third-party lenders that we discussed, and also think about trying to get the, um, uh, the, the seller to do a seller finance. Um, those are really two big avenues if you're buying a mobile home that a lot of people don't think about and a lot of people just feel like, oh gosh, like, you know, I guess I'm, I'm, I can't get the house, I'm going to have to live here or there. And, and they're not happy with it. Uh, don't don't fall in that category. Okay, uh, be educated on these three different options. Uh, number one is going to be the cash. Number two, the mortgage. Number three is possible or sell, seller financing. Be educated on these. Understand them, and uh, go out there and find yourself a beautiful uh, mobile home for your for yourself and your family. So, guys, if you had any uh, found any value in this, make sure you leave a comment, uh, smash the like button, blow, and make sure you subscribe uh, to the channel uh, so that you're up to speed on all that. We greatly appreciate you uh, you being a part of the community. We look forward to more folks joining us on our journey to uh, to help uh, bring all this information to you and everyone else in the mobile home space. This is Mark Kaiser with the Mobile Home Dealer. Thank you so much for being a part of this. We'll see you on the next one.